All right, hey guys, OFD checking in here, and today we have a watch from Talker. I'm really excited to get to take a look at this watch. I want to thank Ivan at Three Hand Media for sending this one out to me. I'll leave a link to his channel down below in the description. Also, this watch will be going to Chris at Marshall Time, so I'll leave a link to that channel also down below. So Talker is a newer company. They were started back in 2017 in Austin. Uh, the founder, his name is actually Austin, and... Um, he wanted to design watches with kind of a militaristic feel or a background. His father, his grandfather, excuse me, was a, a pilot in the um, military back in World War II. And so his watches, the Air Defender, they've got the D-Day, they've got the USS Texas model. They've got watches that are named after military um, feats, ships, um, military type things. So anyways, this is the Air Defender. This is the Hulk model. Pretty obvious why they're calling this the Hulk model. Uh, the green, it's also, it's a big watch. These come in at 45 millimeter case size, lug to lug. You got 48, uh, um, excuse me, side to side 45, 48 lug to lug. So it's, it fits the wrist well, being that's under 50, 22 millimeter lug openings, and you do have a 15 millimeter thick watch. Now this watch is an automatic chronograph watch. We'll go ahead and get the chronograph started here. You see that ticking around. This is running the Valju 7750 movement. So there's a really high end, very well built uh, movement um, in this watch. Uh, 25 joule movement in here. Um, 42 hour power reserve is generally what you're going to get on these. Uh, 28,800 uh, vibrations per hour. So it's a true high beat movement. So you've got impressive functionality. You also get a day to date functionality over here at the three o'clock position. Now with the Valju 7750, let me go really quickly through the, how the chronograph functions work. So I've got the chronograph running, which is going to be your main center hand here spinning around that nice green one you can see. That's keeping track of your seconds once you start your chronograph functionality. Up here at the top at the 12 o'clock position, that's a minute counter for up to 30 minutes. Um, so you can keep track of the minutes of the, of the chronograph functionality. And down here at the bottom, this is going to be your hour functionality for that chronograph up to 12 hours. So it's really a, a high use chronograph. You can use it for measuring all sorts of things. Not only that, on the Air Defender, they've included this internal uh, spinning bezel. So you can use this for other type of timing you know, that you want to do. It's just a really very nice functional chronograph watch. Screw down crown on both of the crowns, the main crown and the uh, crown for the bezel. This is a 100 meter waterproof watch, so no problem with that. You can use this for water sports. Of course, never um, use your pushers when you're in the water on any kind of a waterproof watch like that. Um, so they offer this watch in a few different colorways. Um, I know there's a blue, there's a black. Um, they also offer it on a stainless steel bracelet. This is the Hicks uh, leather bracelet is what they're calling or strap, I should say. Impressively well-made strap. This is a made in America U.S. Uh, strap on here. Calf skin leather. Very, very nicely done. And since we flipped it over, you can go ahead and take a look at that incredibly decorated Valju 7750. This is, an, uh, I guess what you consider like an elabor movement. It's a highly decorated movement. You can see it does have that custom rotor in there that they're using on the watch. Really, really cool. Almost looks like a turbine uh, on a jet or something like that. Doesn't it kind of look that way? Also, the information you want to know about the watch, the water resistance, using the sapphire crystal gives you the information about the movement also there on the case back. But really, really cool watches from Talker. So um, high functionality. You've got a true chronograph movement here with the Valju 7750, a true automatic movement here. Now, these watches are not inexpensive. Um, this particular model right now on the website is going for $1,850, which when you consider um, you know, what this watch is, Swiss made, American designed, um, everything in it's the highest grade you can get really, to be honest with you. And they're very unique and well-built watches. You're not going to run into a lot of people wearing Talker watches. I think they're really a, a specialty watch out there. And if you're a collector, it's probably something you're really kind of into. I mentioned to one of my local friends who's a collector that I had one of these to look out on the channel. And he got really excited about it because he knows the brand. He knows the, the background of the brand. He knows they're very, very well-built watches, very unique uh, very, very nice watches. So let's go ahead and pause it, get this watch on my 7-inch wrist, and then we'll go up that wrist, uh, the loom shot. All right, so here's the Talker Air Defender, the Hulk, on my 7-inch wrist. It's a big, big watch, but this strap makes it fit super comfortable, 
Being that you have my under 50 lug tip to lug tip, the watch actually sits on my wrist well. You're not going to get away from the thickness, guys, on these watches once you go to these Valju 7750 movements. Um, there's a lot going on inside of these movements. Um, and I tell you what, you can tell these movements are working when you wear it. You, you roll it around on your wrist. You can feel that rotor moving. It feels extremely mechanical and very, very well built. Let's go ahead and stop this chronograph, and I'll show you guys that snapback functionality of that Valju 7750. But... Great, great looking watch on the wrist. Definitely looks good. So let's go ahead and kill the lights and see what the loom looks like on this one. All right, so already getting some good glow just by turning down the lights in here. I didn't mention to you guys, over there at the 9 o'clock position, you can see it with the light. That's your running seconds on the watch. It's this little loomed hand over here. That's actually your running seconds. So that's why that one is loomed all the time, because you want to know that, that that second hand is moving there. So you notice the chronograph hands are not loomed, but your main hand set, your indices on the watch, and your second hand there over at the nine o'clock position is Loom. So great looking handset on this watch. I, I really like everything about it. So guys, go ahead and check them out um, over at the website. I'll leave a link down below in the bottom. If you guys like the video, give me a thumbs up down there at the bottom. And if you've not subscribed to the OFD channel yet, please do. Please do. Thanks, guys.